thoughts about the downhill mile. You know what? I think it's going to be an exciting event. It's going to be some new people racing. I hear David Torrance is quite the stud. I've seen the video of the second annual. I don't know. Is David going to defend his title? Or who knows? Maybe someone else will show up and beat him. Well, we've got a big field, you know, we got uh, David Torrance and Eric Lee. You know what? It's not about quantity, it's about quality. Go for the win. That's all that matters, the win. You know what? I know David Torrance pretty well, and he only runs this when he knows he's ready to go. You know, at this point I'm getting kind of old, so uh, not to worry much about times per se, just worry about other domination. Downhill mile, baby! <laughs> We're ready. Yeah. Alright, so today is a special day. It's November 22nd, which is David Torrance's birthday. Um, we're here at the UC Berkeley dirt track. It's kind of the, the training track, warming up uh, for a special event that David Torrance helped start back when he was at Cal, and that's the downhill mile. And today, we've got Belota, Ellis, John, and Tom all running it together. So it'll be the first time that I've personally seen a real race happen on the downhill mile. We're doing it to honor David Torrance's legacy and memory. Um, he was a, a good friend to a lot of us and a mentor, um, especially in my case. And you know, uh, it's really tough not having him around anymore, but we're keeping his memory alive by doing this and hoping that we can make a bit of a tradition out of it that sticks around for, for the long term. So here we go. Here's one of our competitors. Oh yeah, John. Talk to me. Talk to me about what's what's happening right now. Give me your thoughts. Uh, well, I heard about this two days ago, and uh, ever since I was, you know, humbled by the opportunity, inspired by the challenge, and just want to go head to head against Ellis over there. Ooh. Honestly, I'd be pretty intimidated to race him in a mile. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love your energy. Thanks for coming out, John. Oh, heck yeah. We're going to do this shit. Heck yeah. All right, we got Ellis Newton here. He's one of one of our our favorites for for taking down this uh, this 349. Is that what David Torrance ran? Do you know? I think it was 345. 345. Are you gonna t attack that record today? That's pretty impressive. We'll see. <laughs> I did 410 last time, but that was my first try. We'll see if I can hit that record. <laughs> I'm just kidding, man. I won't put that pressure on you. <laughs> but talk to me. Talk to me about what the downhill mile means to you and and what's happening. Well. The story I've been told is David had this idea back when he was in college and he killed it first try. Since then it's become kind of an heirloom event, something special that we all share and we're keeping that tradition alive today. Yeah. Did you ever have a chance to meet David? I don't know. You might have been a little young. But I'm uh, not sure. A couple of times. Yeah. He came to visit a few meets. He saw me win a race and then he complimented my kick. Nice. And I like, Ooh, that's a compliment on high. What more could a fan ask for, you know? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Belota. Yeah. We're here with our second downhill mile of the year. And uh, talk, just talk to me about why, why this one in particular is special. Uh, for one, it's my first one. I've never done one. I've managed to miss every single one that's ever happened. To miss it. That's a good way of putting it. Yeah, somehow, you know, just I was never invited or decided to skip it or whatever. <laughs> But, uh, but you know, just in honor of David, it's something that was kind of special to him. And, you know, I just want to kind of make it like a, another tradition, you know, Cal tradition yeah. race. And uh, just just preview the course myself so I can actually put on like a really good, good like annual event, you know, for the years to come to just honor David. Yeah. So uh, it's a good day to do it. And thanks to COVID, you know. No, there won't be a lot of people blocking the way. <laughs> exactly, <actually>. yeah. So <laughs> we're doing it at 6 a.m., 7 a.m. by the time we start. So hopefully we don't get hit by by some cars. I'm sure we'll be all right. All right. We'll make it through. Yeah, I hope so. Cool. All right. All right. Thanks, Bloda. Yeah. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. For the record, I also happened to miss them. And he goes to 
bad, but we're bad. Yeah. What, below death? Yeah, he's never done one because it used to be run at night and he's in bed by about 8.30 at night. <laughs> He does. He's, a, he's been an old man since he was 15 years yeah. old. <laughs> so, Tom, talk to me just a, a quick sec. What does the downhill mile mean to you? Have you run one? I have. Yeah? I was there for the first one. Nice. That's oh, awesome. Sorry. Yeah. It, uh, it's just a great time to come out and, and run in memory of David and uh, try to run fast and this year try not to get hurt. So. <laughs> yeah, that becomes <laughs> more and more the goal each year, right? <laughs> it's the goal. <laughs> Awesome. Well, thanks so much and yeah. good luck with thank you, thank for you out there. <laughs> so, what do we got going here? Why do you have a van? This is the this is the athlete van. The athlete van. And uh, today, in particular, uh, we need to use the van to block specific roads so the athletes can <laughs> uh, stay competitive. Are you saying that this is an unsanctioned event? Uh, today, yes. In the future, no. I like your optimism. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All Thank right. you for volunteering to do this. I'll see you out there. So this is the official start of the downhill mile in Berkeley. We're at the International House, which is right at the top of Bancroft. So they're gonna be running down there. And exactly a mile from this start of the pavement right here is the end of Bancroft. So it actually works out really perfectly. So I'm excited. I wish I could be running, coming off an injury, but next year, you better watch out. About that. Do you want me to give you a command? Yeah, yeah, please. All right, so you're all responsible for getting your own timing. We're going on the honor system this year. But so the commands will be on your marks, get set, and go. And then we're going to have some fun. So runners to your marks, get set, go. And they're off. All right, got to catch them. this. Ellis, tell me that that's not true. What, what'd you run? According to my watch, I ran 5.86 seconds. Oh, <laughs> man. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. Where did you get second? Yeah. Man, uh, hell yeah. What'd you run? Did you have a time? Yeah, 4.10. 4.10? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So not I bad mean, for a nice. we know. Sunday morning. <laughs> you probably broke four then. Let's hope so. That'd be really nice. Oh, wow. 
Tom, let me hear your let me hear your thoughts, man. How, how'd uh, that go? You're healthy, it seems. I'm, I, well, so far, yeah, nothing nothing blew on the way down. It'll probably blow later today. I broke five minutes for the first time in uh, probably 16 years. <laughs> nice. So we'll count it. You know, I, <laughs> Congrats, man. <laughs> Thanks for blocking the road right as soon as the cop rolled up, too. The van, had a, the van came in handy today. The cop gave the okay, and uh, we made it through. <laughs> we did. Yeah. Exactly. All right, Belota. Yeah. Talk to me, man. How'd it go? What would you run, fun, like 412 man. or something? 411. 411? Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. Pretty good. John kept me at it. <laughs> Yeah, I almost stumbled and fell on my face. Did you see that? Uh -huh. I, yeah, I saw that at the beginning, but I, I didn't catch it on camera, unfortunately. Well, yeah, wearing those cheating shoes that just wrong shoe. Forward. Yeah, these you don't are... want to be running down no one. No, that's an amateur mistake. Right Big there. time. <laughs>